Good afternoon. My name is Maciej Mitrenga and I am the head of postgraduate business English studies. Uh, let me give you a couple of reasons to join us at the University of Economics in Katowice this year. The first thing, globalization of companies nowadays. Let's take Poland as an example. Big Polish companies are more and more co competing on European and global market. For example, ASECO, a main producer integrator of IT in Central Europe, uh, Solaris, uh, the main producer of tram and, ba and buses uh, in Central Europe, uh, operating uh, in more than 26 uh, countries uh, nowadays. If you are working in such a company, or if you are thinking about applying for position in such a company, then you would definitely need to improve your English language capabilities. Uh, on the other hand, small companies uh, operating in Poland. Let's take uh, companies like a uh, local producer of furniture. If you are such a company, you can think uh, globally. For example, there are a lot of companies that are already uh, cooperating with such giants as IKEA even being small, but to cooperate with such uh, uh, companies you need to be able to communicate with them and that demand English language capabilities. The second reason, labor market globalization. Uh, let's think about uh, the situation globally and in Poland as an example. My friend is a German 26 years old. He started studying in Bamberg, in Germany. He has done a bachelor degree there. Then he moved to United States. He needed English language capabilities for that, for that. And he finished master degree there. But now he finally moved to another country, which is UK and uh, the place is London. And he, he works in a big institution right now. For, if you treat this uh, person as a case, then you may see that actually for a, uh, for a good career boost you really need to stay flexible and it involves both English language capabilities and the intercultural capabilities. So join us to improve these two areas. The third reason is that English language is not just to learn but to practice. I would like to give you my personal example. I was learning English in Poland for more than 10 years, then I, I've done a PhD degree in Poland and after that uh, in 2010 I moved to University of Manchester, Manchester Business School to uh, do some uh, research there. And uh, from the very beginning of my visit, I realized that actually my English language capabilities are very difficult to introduce smoothly when I interact with living, per living persons there. Uh, I was involved in the uh, operations of the very international department where the majority of scholars were from other countries and the head of the division was uh, German uh, originally. So I needed to improve my English language capabilities, I, I needed to improve my uh, intercultural capabilities and then uh, after a year of um, my research there I realized that the main uh, vehicle for me to achieve all of this was actually English practicing. Every day with uh, people from different cultures, with people from di with different levels of um, language skills. So, what I can promise for sure is that here at the Postgraduate Business English Studies you can practice a lot of English, not only learn, not only uh, uh, be involved in the lectures. The majority of classes are very interactive. We have the typical academic lecturing minimized very much. So, this is an opportunity for you this year, I believe. 
If you want to learn more about uh, our postgraduate studies in the business English area, visit our website. Thank you very much.